Audio components are used for playing and manipulating sounds in Unreal Engine 4. There are some ways to get a reference of them. You need it if you don't want to play sound once and remove it from memory. And if you want to use the same sound constantly or change sound's properties somehow. The simplest way to add audio component into Blueprint is to make Blueprint of empty actor and add audio from add component menu. Then inhabit it with your sound. If you place this empty actor on scene, the sound will play when you start level. If you don't need it, you should switch off auto activate. You can set audio components with sound wave or sound cue variables. You can use them like as private and as public variables. What will you do if you need to have an audio component reference in level blueprint? You can't add components here, but you can use spawn sound 2D. Output of this function is actually audio component. You should uncheck auto destroy checkbox. You need variable that will contain your audio component. If you don't need it to play right away, you should use stop function. Another way of getting it, you can make actor reference by choosing an actor on the scene, open level blueprint, right click, check context sensitive and click create reference of actor of your choice. Then find node called get component by class which target is actor and choose auto component. Create variable and inhabit it with component you've got. What if you want reference in another actor on scene? First we need to get actor reference can be done by get all actors of class or tag, which returns array of actors. We have to make for each loop to set variable with actor you're looking for. Then to do the same thing as in level blueprint, get component by class. You can also make editable variable of type actor object reference within actor and inherit it with level editor.
Another way is to spawn actor or widget from existing actor on scene and inherit audio component from it. In a target blueprint you need to make audio component variable and open it for edit and expose on spawn. When you set not spawn actor of class you'll get audio variable input. 